also coach with you, Coach Larry Brown. I'm glad you had an opportunity to catch up with Larry Brown because uh, Larry was my captain, my second team. He's a junior, my first team. He was assistant coach for two years, and I think he's a great coach, whether it be pro, college, and I really think he should have stayed in the college ranks, but he appears happy now. Excellent coach in the NBA. This talk with Larry brought to you by Fisherman Friends Cough Lozenges. They work, they have to. I think the first time I ever put on a Carolina uniform was the greatest thrill I ever had. Um, and, and that was uh, my freshman year. Just being part of that, realizing what had been done before you got there. Um, but now the thing that stands out to me is I take great pride in that I was part of something that's pretty special. And Larry Brown has been pretty special himself having left his mark on basketball, both collegiately and professionally, as a player and a coach. Brown continues to carry on the winning tradition he learned while in Chapel Hill. His Tar Heel career began in 1961 as a highly successful Carolina point guard. Then, after coaching with Dean Smith at Carolina, he went on to professional basketball, where he's been a success as a player and a coach. And he made me appreciate the game. That's why I, I got into coaching. Uh, and I'm sure players like Eddie and Roy, um, Doug Moe, Billy Cunningham, people like that would probably have the same feeling. I think that's the neat thing. Um, you're talking to me right now, but you could put any, anybody in this chair that is associated with Coach Smith and Carolina basketball, and they'd say the same things. It might come out a little better than uh, the way I expressed it, but there's going to be similarities. Those same things are now said about Larry Brown as well. A winner everywhere he goes, Brown is one of the most sought after coaches in the country whenever a coaching vacancy appears. He credits his success and his popularity to his teacher and former coach. And when a Larry Brown team takes the floor, a little bit of that Tar Heel tradition is always evident. Well, I'd be flattered if they thought I was I had a lot of the same similarities that Coach Smith had. That would be the greatest compliment. I, uh, I love what I do, and I think the main reason I love what I do is because I learned from somebody who really cared about me. And uh, I don't always project it the way I should to my players, but I try. And try he has. In Brown's more than 20 years of coaching, he's had only one losing season. He has turned NBA programs into winners, and he won an NCAA championship at Kansas. So many times people put too much emphasis on winning on the national championship. Uh, the thing that I'm excited about is you look at Carolina year in and year out, and they're competing for a national championship. Their kids graduate. They got class guys on the court. Um, so that's what it's all about. Uh, certainly you always try to win a championship. It's funny, when when I was with Coach Smith at, at Carolina, we talked about trying to win a championship. Well, you go to other programs, they talk about maybe being 500 or getting in the NCAA tournament. Um, that shows me a little bit about our program. With all the success of Brown's basketball programs, some fans may forget where it all started. But Coach Larry Brown is quick to point out his hoop roots. When all is said and done, it's Coach Smith, in my mind. Uh, he treats you like family. He never forgets you. Uh, he always makes you feel like you're part of it. Um, no matter what team's on the floor playing, um, you're still a part of that. And, and it's him. Uh, I owe him everything, because uh, I've always wanted to be a coach. Um, coaches in my life have always been important to me. And it, I've been very fortunate that I've had the greatest one to try to emulate.